Now, from your local news leader, this is 6 News. We start with breaking news off the top tonight. Police are just now setting up the crime tape around the scene of a suspicious death. That tape is going up on Sweet Street, which is near Page Avenue in Jackson. Our Nick Perot is there live. And Nick, we know this is very early in the investigation, but what do we know at this point? Well, Greg, at this point, what we can tell you is the crime scene unit is still on the scene right now, and they have been here since about 2 this afternoon trying to figure out why a Jackson man has died today. Now, around 2 this afternoon, this all started when a state trooper arrived here for an investigation into check fraud. When an officer arrived near this house, he tried to see inside if there was anybody, and looking through kitchen windows, found what he appeared to be a body on the floor, and he also noticed a woman inside. He then contacted the state and Jackson Police Department, who confirmed shortly thereafter there was a body of a Jackson man who had died. Now, right now, at this point, they're not sure if the check fraud case and death are related. They're still trying to figure out the cause of death and are treating this as a suspicious homicide. Uh, we don't know if it's a homicide yet. We're treating it as such, though. Okay. Um, it, it definitely is suspicious, um, especially when we get here. Uh, the state trooper investigating a fraud and a check fraud. And there's a dead body inside of the residence. So that, that's a, a huge concern for us right now. And we are back out here live. And I am told that the woman inside was sent to a local hospital with injuries that appear to be unrelated to this case. But police say she is listed as a person of interest as she did not contact the police with a dead body inside the house. Make sure to stay with 6 News for the very latest on this case. For now, live in Jackson, Nick Perot, 6 News. All right, Nick, thank you. To another developing story now, a dramatic accident in Leroy Township.